Hi, I'm Ralph Scripet, known as the Wild Chef. I have been fishing and shooting since the age of eight, and the passion is about bringing game to the table with new, fresh ideas using local in-season produce. Now let's go and cook some great game dishes. Today we have caught a Dorset River rainbow trout and we're going to be using British asparagus combined with new potatoes in the holiday sauce with the idea to smoke the fillet of trout with some herbs and pimp peppercorns. So we've gutted it already, so we're just going to take the fillets off here. And here we just use the knife and just cut along. Okay, fantastic. Okay, we can do away with this one. Okay, here. And just take a little bit of the spine away here to reveal the fillet. And here. We just want to take the little bit, the rib bones away. So here we just nip them away, tidy it up a little bit by cutting on. Look at the lovely colour of this. Trout, it's obviously been here, in here a few months, being a rainbow that's been stocked. But it's taken on that lovely river taste, which is beautiful. So just trim that down a little bit. Nice little bit of handy pliers here, and we're just going to nip these little pin bones out here that run along here. You see, just gather them up. Okay, now we want to get a nice little bit of herb ready. And here we've got some lovely rose peppers. Okay, get some lovely parsley. And I just want to chop that up a little bit so it breaks down, gives the flavour of the parsley. A few twists of sea salt. Okay, and we're ready to give this a real good crunch up. A little dabble of olive oil. That will help the mixture to really grind up. With the sea salt, that is crunching all that parsley. Really extracting all the flavour giving us a real nice mix to brush over the fillet. Okay, let's let's do that now. It's getting nice. See those lovely vibrant colours, the reds, the peppers, the rose peppers. It's just going to be really, really nice. Okay, that's good. Let's get rid of that. A few little twists of the pepper as well, just a little bit. Okay, we're ready to go in our smoking tray here. Here we've got some lovely wood chippings just in the bottom here. And we're gonna lay the fillet with the skin side so that'll protect it over the top. Okay, and a little bit of foil to really crimp it in. And that means we, we don't need an oven because it'll literally cook really well in there. So let's get that straight on the heat. Okay, we're gonna do a lovely sauce now, um, a hollandaise sauce, but we wanna get the other bits of ingredients together. We've got some lovely new potatoes that have been boiling away in here. So we're gonna do some hollandaise with that, some little bit of asparagus as well. So let's get that on the boil now. Asparagus, great for this time of year. We'll just nip the ends off and we can drop them straight in. In with the new potatoes there, let's cook them both at the same time so they're nice and warm. That's had about five minutes on there, but I'm not gonna open that yet. I'm gonna let that just sit there and rest, and really get that lovely smokiness uh, around the fish. Okay, so now onto our sauce. We've got asparagus in there, we've got our new potatoes in there, so we need to get this water nicely boiled up, ready for our um, holiday sauce. Okay, these should be done, so we can pop these out, sit them on the side here. Great, let's get a 
Sure. Okay, and these can pop out as well. So they're just lovely, just tender to the touch. They're lovely. Okay, so let's get to the sauce now. You need a couple of eggs, which we're just going to drop in there, but it's not the actual um, egg whites we need, so we're going to get rid of that. I'm just going to dispose of that. We just want the, the actual yolk itself. So let's just drop the white. Okay, brilliant. That's good. Okay, we need some white wine in there, just a touch. Okay, as the water heats, it's going to heat the yolk, which in turn is going to sort of make it quite thick, really. A little few twists of pepper. Just a small twist of sea salt. And it will rise, it will sort of, the egg yolks will work to sort of cream the sauce, if you like. So I'm going to just lift that out for a second. Okay, because we want the other ingredients in there. So here we're going to slice the potatoes. And here we've got some lovely, this is garlic chives, which is absolutely beautiful. And we're just going to have that. Just break them up a little bit so you release the flavour. You can smell it straight away, smell that lovely garlic. Right, let's get our plate together. Okay, let's reveal the trout. See the lovely colours on that. That's absolutely beautiful. Let's move everything to the side. Might wait for this. And this will just come off beautifully. And here we can just flip it over. You can see right, and look at the lovely texture on that. The beautiful colour, absolutely beautiful. And this is the side we'll present, this side, and one side like this as well. So let's start putting the dish together. Okay, this back on, just to warm through. Okay, it's looking great. Okay, in here, we need to put the ingredients so the potatoes go in or the, the curly parsley and those lovely garlic chives. Give that a little turn. Okay, we can start building the dish up. It's lovely coated in that lovely hollandaise sauce. Okay, we can put our asparagus, little bundle along the side. Okay, we can put a lovely fish, and that's, that's absolutely beautiful smoked fish over the top there. Again, these little garlic chives, just sprinkle over the top. And there we have a lovely, lovely summer dish in a lovely Dorset river here. And uh, you couldn't really ask for any anything more, but I've got to taste it, because this looks absolutely lovely. Let's have a little taste of here with the potatoes. Oh, the lovely smoky flavour, the actual chives and the garlic coming through with a lovely hollandaise sauce. You couldn't ask for anything more. And such a lovely river. Absolutely superb.